Horizontal mattress interrupted everton pattern. This is uh, very useful if you have much tension on your incision. If, for instance, if you're closing skin. You see here, this is a what I call a far, near, near, far pattern. If you see it from the surgeon's point of view. So I start far, then I go to near to myself, and then I load the whole needle holder opposite of what I usually would do in order to have the right grab on my needle. So here you see the far near, near pattern. Now I'm tying the suture with a surgeon knot 211. As you see here, when I tightened, when I tightened the suture, the suture slips a little. When you're using this suture pattern for skin closure, please make sure to use a monofilamentic and non-absorbable suture. Here we go again, the far, near, and then near far. I'm not grabbing the suture with my needle holder. I load the the suture again with the needle holder opposite of what I normally would do. And then I make the knot. You see here we make the knot with the another pattern where you make three throws instead of two. It makes it easier to tie the knot without the suture slipping. You see here that this is an everting pattern. When you remove the stitches after healing completed, the everting pattern will disappear and will find its right position.